Sometimes they're loving, sometimes they're challenging, and often they're a little bit of both. But none of us would be here without a mom. And since it is their special day, it's our topic in tonight's Say What. If I think when Rudy gets to be 13, we should run away from home. For good? Bummer, don't make fun of grad students. They just made a terrible life choice. Or bad, they are some of our favorite moms. Love you, Mom. <laughs> but on a soggy day in Nubo, when Mother Nature rained on her own parade, we found many of you praising your mothers and their best advice, like a strong work ethic. I mean, I've held the same job for 17 and a half years, and I, I, I attribute it to her. Or making the most of every day. What makes you happy? Um, stick with it and... You know, just live life, have fun. On our Facebook page, Patty says, my mom always repeated the quote, it's nice to be important, but it's more important to be nice. And Denise writes, my mom would always kiss my dad goodbye because they would never know if they would see each other again. Meantime, back in Nubo, it's three generations of Lokers and Krauses, all with great advice from mom. Teach your children to sleep late. Absolutely, it'll make you happier. My mother had a habit of just sort of accepting what came to her. And I don't know that I'm there yet, but I'm working on it. Teach your children to be joyful, because you can't learn that as easy later in life. <laughs> How are you doing with that? I don't know. How are we doing with that? <laughs> are you joyful? <laughs> I don't know. OK, that's the thunder. That's not joy. It must be a sign. It must be a sign. Somebody not happy about the thunder. Now you can post the best advice your mom ever gave you right now on our Facebook page.